So here I'm going to do a left turn again. So I creep up and I go half a circle, just that. And then I pull it back. There you go, that's that. Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to make a left turn at a major intersection. In my left turn video, a lot of people ask me, Herminder, does this trick apply to wide roads, major intersections? Also, the answer is no, because uh, you know you turn the wheel more at um, uh, on, on side streets because the streets are a little sharper. Here, since you make a wide turn, you would not need to turn the wheel as much. So I'm going to demonstrate, so take a look. I'm going to show you the foot angle also so that you know how much I'm accelerating when I'm using the brake and when I'm using the gas. So here it is, so I'm going to go forward. Now I can't tell you at what angle I'm starting to turn. So what I do is I usually just look where I want to go and turn the wheel accordingly. So what you noticed here was that I didn't turn the wheel too much. It was, it was I think, not even half a circle. So I, we're gonna try it again and see how much the wheel turns. So in the side street video that I'd shown, it was half a circle and then a quarter, so three quarters basically. But uh, on a major street at a major intersection, you turn only half a circle. So here I'm going to do a left turn again. So I creep up and I go half a circle, just that. And then I pull it back. There you go. That's that. Half a circle is how much you need to turn. So that's verified now. So, hey, again, this is not a thumb rule, right? So it depends. Sometimes the intersection would be wider than this. Then. In that case, you would not need to turn even half a circle. Sometimes you would uh, need to turn on a street that's, uh, you know, that's smaller and the angle is also sharper. So in that case, you would need to turn a little more than that, right? Then you follow the technique that I showed you for the side street. So it, it actually depends on how wide the street is. You will have to make your judgment. Now again, do not worry too much about it, right? After having driven for a bit, for like six to seven hours, you will get an idea as to how much you need to turn the wheel. I would say as a new driver, do not stress too much about it. Everything will become a muscle memory. You, you would learn to drive before you know. Uh, so, so don't worry about it. Do not stress too much. Driving is easy peasy, easy peasy okay the guy next to me is looking at me why is this guy talking to himself well he doesn't know that I have around hundred thousand subscribers that I'm helping so I care less my friend so that's it my friend comment below and let me know what do you find easier to do doing a left turn or a right turn or a u-turn I don't know if someone likes a u-turn well Thank you very much for watching this video, my friend. Thank you for subscribing. I will see you again with another video.